Hey guys, it is Roblox Swirl here, and today we're taking a look at Netflix response to Roblox and what they said. But before we dive right into today's video, I do only know we're gonna be doing videos just like this one all the time. So make sure to hit that like button and subscribe button. Don't forget about the bell icon as well. We're gonna be doing videos just like this one all the time. And you would not wanna miss out on any of the content we post on the channel. With that out of the way though, let's go ahead and hop right into today's exciting and awesome video. After the hit series, Squid Game released out on Netflix and became one of the most successful shows on Netflix's history ever, which was Squid Game. Squid Game was a phenomenal series for sure and kind of honestly surprised everyone. Everyone was so shocked and surprised. After so long, Netflix released a series that was actually good and ju just good, but super entertaining. Something that drew you in and you couldn't stop watching episode after episode. Each episode would air and you would be sitting there watching it, glued to your screen, wondering what happened to the characters. The characters you would fall in love with and then be in tears when they died. This series was so thrilling you could not put it down. And because of this thrilling series and how the season one ended, people wanted more. People wanted an escape. People wanted to experience it. And well, since there's not really an official game for it, there was a meme that kind of floated on Twitter that everyone realized one thing and they all looked to Roblox. And this is what caused one of the biggest uproars I've ever seen on Roblox in years. I mean, Piggy was a huge hit, but nothing I have yet to see something like Squid Game. Now, if you guys don't know, Squid Game is pretty much where these people are in the survival horror, where essentially you have all these characters that are in debt. And in order to pay off their debt, they have to work off their life, pretty much, and there's nothing else for them to do but just work till they die. But hey, this guy basically gave them an invite to come join these games where you play children's games. And if you win, you get billions of dollars, right? Seems fine and safe. But matter of fact, it's far from safe. And well, unfortunately, if you don't actually complete the games, you die. So yeah, it's a high stakes game. But with that being said, there were games that were being originally put on Roblox. And one of the first ones was so hilarious because it blew up on Reddit and Twitter where people would have to get in these beds to wait for the game to load. But you actually had to wait till everyone was in a bed and an admin to join the server to turn it on because there was not an auto start to the game. Which was absolutely hilarious and blew up all over Twitter. This is how people realized that Roblox had games of Squid Game. And then a ton of creators like PewDiePie, Ludwig, XQC, Pokimane, and many more huge names would play on Roblox Squid Game and absolutely enjoy it to death. People were having a blast with it thinking it was one of the best series on Roblox. People started to understand that Roblox isn't just a platform for kids, but for all ages. And it was a blast to just see all these YouTubers that typically don't really do a lot with Roblox and sometimes even knock Roblox a lot about how it works and just kind of enjoy it. I mean, Pokimane literally spent money on Robux. How crazy is that? And then even Jacksepticeye wound up playing the game for hours and got lost in the game. It just shows how much these guys are loving the game, which is pretty much the reason why we're making today's video because people were curious whether or not Roblox was gonna have to take down these games by Netflix. And well, I thought so too because of copyright issues. I mean, we could take a look at Pokemon Brick Bronze and many other examples like the Fall Guy games, like all these games that got taken out because of copyright. And because Netflix is a huge corporation, I really thought this was just not gonna last for very long, but Here's the thing, guys. Netflix literally said that they didn't care. They thought it was really cool. Even if somebody was making a little bit of money off their series, they were okay with it. It's something that you guys get to enjoy, and they didn't want to take it away from the people. So, that's really awesome of them. But anyways, guys, that is our video on Roblox Squid Games and what Netflix had to say about it. If you guys enjoyed today's video, hit the like button and subscribe button, and we'll see you in another amazing video. Bye-bye, guys.